Hey guys, it's Pokecon 14. I'm here with part 13 of my shiny Pokemon Diamond and Pearl walkthrough. In this episode, we are going to be taking on the Eterna Forest. Right in that way, there, where my finger was. No, okay, whatever. The way my character is facing. But yeah, I'll stop talking and describe the video. Wait, that means I'm talking. Okay, whatever. I am just going to be giving you this introduction, and for the rest of the video, uh, except for two parts of the beginning and end that I'm going to have to show, I will be speeding up 2x and being doing a post-narration over it so you won't get bored. Because I hate it when people just play music over something and speed it up. I always love to hear narrations. And I'm guessing you guys will like that too, so... Without further okay, I'll stop. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get started in the Eternal Forest. And this beginning part, I can't speed up. When you come in here, you're gonna find Cheryl. Yes, my name is Pokecon. I didn't even say that. Psychic. Okay. Okay. What's the big favor? Ooh, yeah, Team Galactic. They use Wurmples. Wait, can't I have a choice in this game? Do I have to say yes? Oh, yeah. And after every battle, she'll heal, heal your Pokemon, so... And over here, before I speed up, you can find an antidote. So, I guess... Ugh. Okay, I'm back, but something weird happened just now. Well, I went into a wild battle, and just as I was about to send out my Pokemon, my game froze, so... Uh, whatever. It's fixed now, and I'm already back here, so I guess time to speed up. I will see you when I post commentate on this. Okay, see ya. In, like, five seconds. Okay, I'll stop talking now. I gotta do that more. Okay, yeah, I didn't really get to do any voiceover on the last four seconds, because, you know, it's only four seconds, but... Okay, here we are in Eternal Forest. I'm going into the first battle now. And it's everything shiny, so it's all really cool. So, uh, yeah, I'm not really doing much. Just sitting here, recording, still talking. And this is a voiceover, so I can't really think of as much to say as I do when I'm not doing a voiceover. So, bear with me here. And yeah, just, I don't know. Forgive me if the voice quality isn't as good. So, what have you guys been up to lately? What have you been playing? Me, I got black and white, and I'm about to start my walkthrough. I am actually, when this video is uploading, I'm going to start filming the first episode of Black and White. Awesome, cool music, sped up double. Yeah, my voice might get a little bit annoying at the time. Connor, just shut up, we don't care. Okay. So yeah, I have already beaten Pokemon White version. And I actually traded out a Pokemon on my team for another one because of the high evolution level of the Pokemon that I just got. So yeah, you guys don't care. I, and if you all know, I traded out on Pheasant for Braviary because you can catch Ruffits or Rufflet. I have my DS right here playing. And it's, yeah, roughly. You can catch those in Victory Road at like level 37 to 40. Huh, let's see what's going on. I haven't even been paying attention to the video and the battle and stuff. But yeah, just facing a psychic, I'm killing them all with bite. Go Zubat. And yeah, the first time I just said this before, it's weird. My game froze. Just randomly froze. Oh yeah, repel. I only have two of them. No wonder I only have to cut out like one or two wild Pokemon battles. Well, I think it's at least two, but okay. I will shut up now. I need to learn to do that more. As you guys have known for a long time. But yeah, in black and white. Back to that talk. Which one did you guys get and what starter did you choose? Tell me some Pokemon on your team and your friend code. In my Pokemon white black and white walkthrough I'll have my friend code posted in every single video unless if I forget so and the white is my main game I'm making black for my walkthrough and I'm still you 
you guys are probably really bored just listening to me talk and talk and talk and talk, but it's better than playing music. And yeah, you guys, do you prefer the music or the voiceover? Because I, for one, hate it when people don't put, when people don't talk for a lot of time. If there's music going, like in some YouTubers, when I'm watching a walkthrough of some games and they like speed up a Pokemon battle or there's a really annoying mission in Mario or something and they put music over it, I usually just go to another tab because I always open up YouTube, Serebii, Twitter, and Facebook at the same time. Yes, I have a Facebook. It's awesome. No, I'm not going to be your guys' friends because you don't even know my last name. I mean, we can be friends on YouTube, guys. Come on. Don't you forgive me. Okay. Whoa, it's getting late. And daily daylight saving saving time was last night, so I don't know. It's just getting too late for me. Oh uh, yeah, it's 4:45 now, and I'm recording this, or well, voiceovering this. Oh, I've been talking for four minutes, and talking, and talking, and talking, and talking, and talking about talking. Huh. Okay then. Whatever. And the part after this, I have a guest star. You guys can probably guess who it is. I mention him a lot. It's Pokey Pizza Six Seven Eight. And. Mm, so yeah, I hope you guys are gonna enjoy that one. The next video, part 14, because this is 13, I think. Oh uh, yeah. Ah, I'm just shaking the camera. I want to see how it would look when I speed it up. Whoa, I didn't remember doing it that crazily. Huh. Okay, sorry about that, like, few seconds without my voice. Because I know you miss my voice so much. And okay, yeah. But I just had to do something. Hey, it's my shirt. Hmm. Uh, that shirt is too big for me. Okay. So I'm facing some more psychics here. <laughs> and yeah, I was trying to decrease the input volume of the voiceover, and it accidentally stopped the voiceover for a minute. That's what happened when there wasn't my voice for a few seconds. You guys might be able to tell, maybe not. But it really doesn't matter. And you know, I just realized something about the editing system, which you guys probably don't even care about. Jeez, I'm 30 seconds over. Darn. Uh, so, I'm bored of talking, so I'm going to play my DS and talk about what I'm doing. I beat White this morning. So, now, oh wow, that guy... I just walked right past that guy, and right as I was going past him, he looked the other way. Hey, I found an Audino in the grass shaking spot. Oh, whatever, I'll put down my DS so I can have more interesting commentary. Did you guys hear that little. Yeah, the tap. That was just my DS. Don't worry. It's fine. It's like, hammer smash! Okay. Whoa, I just saw the input volume go like up to red level or something. I don't know. And um, we're nearing the end of a turn of forest here, and I'm sorry if I didn't cover everything, every item, every trainer, but I was just in a rush to get out of it, because there were some battles that wouldn't end. Okay. So. And, oh, I didn't know that. Eh, whatever. Oh. Uh, oh, wow, I just forgot to speed up this part. Uh... So, you're hearing regular audio now. That's one thing I have to fix, so. Uh. Hold on a minute, you'll hear my voice in a few seconds. Okay, here we go. This is Cheryl's drop off. Yeah, the exit. I'm relieved too. Took too long for these battles. And she just goes off. You get a soothe bell from her in platinum. But I guess now that we're here on Route 205. Oh yeah, let me say something. These fishermen are the biggest waste of time ever. One of the Pokemon? I don't know them all, but I know. Goldine and Magikarp after Magikarp. But okay, now we are here in Eterna City. Uh, and okay, I'll stop talking now.